Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. It's time now for Full That's Circle. That's how you feel it? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's a strong, it's a strong <laughs> dance. <laughs> well, we like to spend a little time discussing a subject that is uh, cool with us, and hopefully you like it as well. You know, a lot of times we set goals for ourselves, mm. weight loss goals, financial goals, career goals that we never reach because we lack motivation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We make excuses for why we cannot start or finish the things that we have set out to do. And today we want to take a little time to discuss our personal motivators. Mm -hmm. uh, ladies, what are some things that continue to motivate you in those times where you're like, oh, God, I don't want to do it? Yeah. Well, I wrote a little piece of a list. No, you got okay. I wrote a little piece of a list. Okay. Okay. Because, okay. you know, I just... <laughs> tried to, tried to do you... Look, I tried to do a little piece of research. Mm -hmm. uh, although some of these we already know common knowledge. Well, um... You know, you guys know that I'm, I'm a Christian. I love the Lord, you know. Yes, absolutely. As we all do. <laughs> right, right. right. The Lord. It's fine. <laughs> but in, in times where um, I just really can't, because I'm self motivated anyway, I've been self motivated my entire life. But in times when I need a little more, I um, lean on the Word of God. Come mm -hmm. on, God. And, you know, you, you lean on God, but the Word of God is a little more specific for right, me. Right. Uh, scriptures like Galatians 6, 9, do not grow weary in well-doing, mm -hmm. for in due seasons you will reap what you sow. If you fight not. If you fight not. not. Uh, Romans 8, 31, if I before you, who can be against you? Philippians 4, 13, you know that one. Mm -hmm. I can do, do all things through Christ. 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 Mm -hmm. That's right. Scriptures like this... Um, have kind of, like, whenever you feel like you can't get it going, yeah. you know what I'm saying? You, you, I go into my closet, yeah. and I meditate on these type of scriptures, mm -hmm. because if God said it, if I before you, who can be against you? That's mm -hmm. another right. one. If he said it, then, then it's true, mm -hmm. so then I got to believe it. Right. But the other thing that gets it popping for uh -oh. me. <laughs> what is this one? The lean. And I know Miss Kwa, I can tell you, you know, <laughs> she, she can go with this one, honey. Them good haters. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I have a good time with them good haters. Right. Yeah, let's go. Just get me, did just get it popping right. for me. Really? Yes. Mm -hmm. I and not to say I like when people hate on me, but I turn what it is that they that that they're trying to do in the universe, because see that's a spirit. I turn what they're trying to do into my motivation for something yes. positive yes. to push me forward. So naysayers, doubters, people that say, I mean, I had a person, child, what back in the do? day, when I had chapter, when I had just finished chapter one, she say. Oh, your first she, album. Oh, my first, first album. album. My okay. first album, Chapter One, Love, Pain, and Forgiveness. Um, she was a background singer. She said, she's not going to make it to Chapter Two. Girl, we got oh. Chapter Six. <laughs> right. I, I, I don't know what you're doing. What what you're doing? doing? What what doing? That, that, yeah. what you do? that very sentence mm -hmm. made me go, oh, I ain't going to make it to Chapter Two. Wow. Watch all these chapters, girl. But uh -huh. she so was it's, the background She was the background, singer. but she wanted to be the foreground, and now she's no ground. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, and, and, she and, and, she, she ain't even on the ground to stand on. So, uh -huh. so I want to say, um, you know, and, and I don't want, mean that in a negative way, but people that doubt me, mm -hmm. um, I turn that energy into uh, the fire. Those sure. are right. the flames on the fire. Right. That is the wood That's on the fire feeling. that really gets it going. Um, and, and then people that are working against me. Yeah. Behind the scenes, well, and I know about it. Right. Ooh. They work against you. Don't they? Right. People that work against you on the low. Yes. Because they're insecure with their own stuff. Mm -hmm. So they're in competition with you silently. Yep. Mm -hmm. Don't let me get away for you either. <laughs> right, right, right. Because then it's really on the pop. Right. So, I mean, the Lord. <laughs> together so eloquently. I'm mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. you, Miss Kwan, because really I know did. we talk about this a lot. My God. Uh -huh. You know, get back there. It's all type of conspiracy. Yes. Yes. <laughs> and guess what you do? What you do keep do? going high. We can win. Right. Win, 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 win. Yes. That's all you do. Win, 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 win. Yes. Curve yes. everything else. Uh -huh. and win, 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 win. Yes. Yes. But what I like to do, for me, um, it's, uh, it's actually the fear of being average. Mm. So that's always been my mo motivation, just the fear of being average. Mm. Um, and, and that's kind of carried me throughout my entire life. Mm -hmm. um, I know that I have some great talents. I know that I'm willing to do the hard work. I'm dedicated to whatever I choose to do. Mm -hmm. And... Um, you know, I don't let anything stop me. Right. Mm -hmm. I never let anything stop me. I don't care. And I ran into, you know, um, some hiccups along the way. Yeah. But I reset myself and That's I say, right. 
steadiest of course you right. must go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. I always do that. So for me, I would I have to tell you all, uh, fear is my greatest motivation. Just mm -hmm. the fear of being average. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's yes. good. That's yeah. good. Mm -hmm. You know what? Everything that you say, you guys have been, ladies have been dead on. Yeah. I actually am motivated by that and also the fact that I want to take care of my family. Like, mm. I don't like seeing my mother after she got, had, uh, after, after she had back surgery, mm. to have to get up and go to work. Yeah. I don't, I don't want that for her. Yeah. I would like to, for her to stay at home because she wants to. Mm -hmm. I would like for her to be able to just go shopping, go mm -hmm. to the casino, mm -hmm. do whatever she wants to do. Mm -hmm. I would like to plant a seed in my brother to start his own business. You know, my thing is, I, I love what I do so much, I would do it for free, but I can't because no, I have bills to pay, right? Yeah, you so I, I oh, can't do it for free, honey. You can't sell yourself <laughs> short. My daddy used to tell me all the time, like, baby, uh, don't sell yourself, but don't give yourself away neither. Mm. Didn't know what that meant until I turned uh, <laughs> the, good, the, good, the, good, the, good, the good age. The good age. <laughs> I knew, good I age. know what he meant now. Yes, but the thing <laughs> is, I would tell you, there is a sermon that's, um, that's preached by Pastor John Gray, mm -hmm. and it says, I am number eight. And quite often, people will count you out, doubt you, forget you. The, the man had eight sons in this particular um, mm. uh, uh, sermon, mm -hmm. and that eighth son was the one that was crowned king. Mm. So every time, people are going to count against you, they're going to hate on you, oh, they're going to say you don't child. deserve. But guess what happens? God will always keep you in the light. And as mm -hmm. long as you believe, pray, and so, mm -hmm. you'll be all right. You yes. make an enemy your foot. Well, how can yes, I don't put your foot on his neck, That's girl. What I'm well, how, how, and I know Shani going to speak real quick, but how can others, let's just think about this. This makes no sense, but think about it. <laughs> Can others be mad at you for for going for it when they're not even moving? Self because they're, when they're standing still, when they're not doing anything, they don't even know how to move. They they envy the fact that you know how. They feel like someone is giving you something that you maybe didn't that deserve. Didn't right. And then they also they want an opportunity, they want a chance. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, it's just about getting up. You got to start with you. You got to right. motivate well, you with yourself. I, you know, if I'm standing still, I can't hate on Kiana for moving. Right. I mean, that doesn't make sense. It doesn't. Shana, what, what motivates you? The fact that I know it's bigger than me. Mm -hmm. I know that's right. This whole thing is bigger than me. Mm -hmm. And that's what continues to motivate me. It has nothing to do with me. I'm merely a vessel. Mm -hmm. that's Come true. on, And welcome. when I have those moments where I'm like, oh my God, what's next? What's next? Whatever doing like that, I'm like, just keep Trust going. Mm -hmm. I know that's and right. keep going because people are tied to your obedience. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You have to do the work that God has called you to do Come on, because someone else is depending on you and that obedience. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When you know that it has nothing to do with you, therein right. lies success, and so that people can look at you and they can change their lives the right. way you How did you move. Yours. How, How you, you move. move. And everything. you may not even know that people are looking at you. Yeah, they That's watching. the part. Oh, they watching. They always watch. They always watch. Absolutely. Watching. Absolutely. So do the things always. that are worth watching. Yes. Mm -hmm. We'd love to hear how you feel. Send us That's your thoughts good. at Sister Circle TV on all of our social platforms. Mm -hmm.